Welcome back to the channel, Daniel Gaming. We're back with yet another video. In today's video, we're going to get on the topic of something I don't really know if I should be talking about, but it's to inform people and like for people that's willing to do YouTube. So I'm going to talk about how much I get paid for one million views. So I just recently hit one million views on the channel, and it's nothing impressive, guys, because honestly, YouTubers don't get paid as much as like you guys would think, especially for small YouTubers. I mean, it helps. It helps get some things done. And but I mean, we're going to go over the topic. So as you can tell this is my channel so subscribe if you are new we're almost at 7k subscribers if we go over here we just surpassed 1 million views granted i joined march 5th 2019 so if we come over to here on december 10th if you go to if you okay so if you guys are doing youtube make sure you guys get tubebuddy because it really helps you it gives you suggested tags and all that for your videos and all that and you can also see milestones and stuff so if you look here, we just hit 1 million views on December 10th. So if you go over to your channel analytics, so far our channel has got 1,018,639 views. And in the last 48 hours, I've made 8,540 views. So my estimated revenue for 1 million views is 3,000. That's literally what I've made the entire year that I've been, that I have been uh monetized i didn't get monetized until i think it was july so if you i mean it's it's a little bit of income but if we come over here to revenue i think it was july yeah july was the first month i was actually able to put ads in my video so july you have to hit a hundred dollars to even get paid for the month so july i didn't even get paid for that month it actually went on to august so july we made ninety dollars August we made 147 September is when things actually started picking up for the channel I felt like we started to grow more as like a community we started getting a bigger fan base we made 467 in September which hey I mean it pays a car payment I, I do this for fun I don't do it for the money I mean it would be nice to do this as a full-time job one day in the future I mean you never know I think that would be nice to be able to spend time with your family, do something from home, put in work, do something you enjoy. I'm always the type of guy that says, follow your dreams, do what you want to do, no matter the, um, no matter what people say. Some people are going to say that's unrealistic. People still don't believe I make any income off money. I still have friends that really doubt that you can make any type of money off YouTube. But I mean, just follow your dreams. I enjoy playing ARK. That's what my channel is based off of. I play ARK. I upload gaming videos because I enjoy them and apparently some of you guys enjoy them too but in October it was when the big change hit October is when our channel actually we started getting like 10 to 15 thousand views a day um, at one point we had I think like 16 17 thousand views in one day October we made 942 November is when I lost power. I didn't upload for a week and we still made 929. So November was a crazy, crazy month. I lost power for like a week in my house. Had to stay at hotels and stuff till they get all that fixed. And yeah, just a lot of things happened. And then of course we're on December now as I'm making this video. We've made 300 so far for the month. So my estimated revenue was 2,954 and then YouTube premium revenue was $57. So over here, you can see my ad types, skippable ads, bumper ads, non-skippable ads, display ads, and non-skippable ads. So of course, most of them are skippable ads. I just think it's annoying to put on ads that people can't skip. Now, if you don't mind, watch the ads through because it really does help us YouTubers. Right here shows, oh, excuse me, the top earning videos on my channel. And a lot of them are actually rat holes. Rat holes are what literally started my channel. I know lately I don't post as many because people are actually enjoying me play the game now, but this is kind of what blew my channel up. Like the ARC top five rat holes for Ragnarok has made me $300. And then, you know, Crystal Wiles really helped my channel when that came out because I was actually a YouTuber during that time. So I could actually talk about some of the newer stuff. So you can see those right there. Over here just kind of shows what I make in a day. It's usually anywhere between uh like roughly 20 to 40 dollars anymore as you can tell wasn't monetized and then during june we uh started making income so yeah i got monetized in june and then i got paid in july that's it that's what it was so yeah as you can tell we were not making anything 
and then September we actually started making decent and then ever since then we make a pretty steady like 20 to 40 dollars a day and then it's all about your play um, back base CPN too, like your um pay per thousand views there is multiple other ways to get paid on YouTube like if you get sponsors we're not a big enough channel in my opinion to have sponsors or anything so maybe in the future we'll get some sponsors and all of that but right now my only revenue on here is ad revenue that's why I still work a full-time job at Amazon um, but yeah I do this for fun and as you can tell my uh, my playback base CPM is it fluctuates anywhere from it used to be around four to five dollars but I feel like now that my contents got better and now that we're making a little bit longer videos and stuff now it's anywhere between six to eight dollars a um, a video which is is nice like you want it to be higher the higher it is the more money you make per video so like you always want to look into what you can do to make it better I feel like longer videos do better for me because you can also have like two mid rolls instead of one there's always a video or an ad at the beginning you can have mid rolls and you can have end I think it has to be I think they changed it to eight minutes to put a mid roll in so what I try to do is if it's under 10 minutes, I will put one mid roll in. If it's over like 15, 20 minutes, I try to put two mid rolls in and I will always try to put one at the end of the video because most of you guys don't make it to the end of the video. For the people that do, I appreciate that. But yeah, so let's just take a look at my last seven days on here. As you can see, my playback based um, CPM is 870 it has been going up quite a bit recently and I'm really enjoying it and my estimated revenue is only hundred and seventy dollars so think of it in real life a say if you make minimum wage you work 40 hours a week YouTube is not like this is why I can't do YouTube as a full job because it just doesn't pay enough at the moment because once I can do YouTube as a full job I will put out much more better videos and all that for you guys but at the time of now I'm working actually right now because of the holidays I'm working 60 hours roughly a week working at Amazon so that's why I've been taking a little bit of a break here and there I do try to upload daily for you guys but I really do enjoy all the feedback I have been getting on the channel I really do appreciate everything you guys have been talking about and like giving me advice and all that I really do appreciate it but just so like upcoming small YouTubers, don't get demotivated. If you want to do this as like a full-time job and this is like your dream, go for it. Yes, you're going to have to work a full-time job on the side until you get to the point that you want to be and that you're comfortable be. But just go for it. Do it for fun. Always do what you want for fun and then like the money and stuff will come later on. So just follow your dreams. Do what you want to do, even if it's gaming, vlogging reaction videos reaction videos though be careful because a lot of things will get blocked and you won't make any money but just go for what you enjoy doing if you want to be a doctor go be a doctor if you want to like go serve in the military go do it do what you want to do just make sure that you just give things time it all comes with time so as you can tell my last 28 days and then our current subscribers and then you know the haters <laughs> but yeah see your videos They'll give you a ranking by views. Like my new video didn't do as well. And then you can come down. You see your recent subscribers and all that. But over here is where your analytics is. And yeah. So that's kind of how how much I have made. And the when I hit 1 million, subs or 1 million views. Um, where is lifetime. So it's not much. And that's why I just kind of upload daily for fun. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this gives you a little idea of what to expect from YouTubers and people that actually put a lot of work into their videos. Show some support. Like their videos. Help them out. But yeah, thank you guys so much for all the support recently. Uh, I appreciate everything. Subscribe if you are new. Like the video. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video.